Okay, this is a quick demo showing how to do retail sales through the point of sale system using Odoo. So this scenario is whereby a retail customer will simply arrive at the store and take, take away some items for which they could either pay by cash or card and the receipt is printed for them and away they go on the merry way. So let's say that someone's come into the store and they want to buy some decking. We go into the decking category, decking boards, find the one that they actually want to buy, specify the quantity, click the cash or card button, let's say they're paying by cash, the amount that they're paying, £9.60, it'll work out their change, so let's say they gave us a tenner, obviously that's 40 pence change, tap on the validate button and that will bring up their receipt, which is ready to print. So I'll just change this to PDF for now. There we go, and you're ready to go to the next order. So, again, let's say the shop's very busy and you start serving a customer. Let's say this one's just getting some, some gloves, two pairs of gloves, and then that customer goes away for some reason. Maybe they have to go down to the yard to get some timber. You can tap on this button here to open a new session for a different customer in the queue, find out what they want, quantity, this time pay by card, type in the amount that they, they're paying and again click validate and the receipt is generated and you can go now with the customers back tap on the number two and you can resume that order so they've so got the two pairs of gloves tap on cash 240 validate and the receipt is ready to be printed ready for the next order. So you can also destroy orders very easily so let's say we've got some flooring being sold, floorboards, let's say we've got 50 of those and that order is no longer needed so we can click the minus button you get a warning I do want to destroy this current order and clicking confirm will erase that order and again clapping next order you're ready to go processing the next order so we'll do one more time just taking an order for some for some fencing. So we'll tap on the fencing category. Notice how the products at the bottom here get less and less the more in depth you go onto the categories. So at the moment it's showing every product beneath the fencing category. So to make it easier to find a product, what you need to do is go into the the subcategory. So let's say we're looking for fence panels, we'll click on fence panels and it will only show us the fence panels. Let's go for that panel. Let's say we've got four of those to, to buy, and customers paying by card, £73.68. And let's apply a discount of 5%. Wait. Go to fencing get some fence panels and let's go for some treated trellis five of those apply a discount of five percent paying by cash and validate and we can see there they've got their cash payment with their discount applied as well perfect next order